Hello everybody, welcome back to City Skylines with me, Biffa. Here we are following this plane. I don't know where he thinks he's going, but for some reason we're following this plane. Oh, it's gone. I'm over a railway line. Well, we are here, we are back, and we are growing nicely in Detroit City. Look at those figures, 94,900 odd. We are really growing and our money's coming back as well, which is good. We spent all of our millions last episode on setting up all of these dams and things and yes this one here i've lowered the land quite a lot and opened it up and there's like a waterfall going off the end of the world now and this one seems to have kicked in and started working yes there we go the water's constantly flowing so we're getting the nice drop there which is fantastic so that means that we are making tons of electricity and we've got more in the bank if we need it because our budget is set to the lowest here so that is fantastic how's our water going yep that's going good so a few things i want to do today oh yeah we've managed to create a little lake here this was all flooded and it just wouldn't run away, so I've just put a, a little hole in the ground and it's all gone down into there. Yay! Right, so this area over here that we made last episode, which has got a ton of people in, causing a few traffic issues, as you can see. It's not as bad as it was, but they're coming off of here um, and they're coming around here and queuing up. So I've added a teeny tiny little island on there just to keep things going. Um, I may just... Can I slightly change that road? Now, do you know what? I'm going to leave it as it is for now. It's actually clearing up a bit. So, what I want to do is encourage these people in this section here to use public transportation. Because we have the monorail going down the side here. And it comes around here and goes down there. There's no nothing down, no nothing down the middle. There's no monorail down the middle. So, we could upgrade this middle section to take monorail it would mean oh we've used the wrong road there it would mean changing this road from six lane to four lane although actually no tell a lie we do have a six lane monorail don't we um i believe do we not apparently we don't we just have the four lane with trams see this has got four lanes down here and this is pretty busy there's lots of people coming out yeah, basically, this junction here is the only connection if they're going to drive to get anywhere. Unless they come over to the trains. Um, shall I change this bit in the middle? We've got this sort of one-way road going around here as well, which is actually probably not helping people get out. Do you know what? I'm going to change that back. Uh, let's get my road. Trying to find the road. Road, road, road. Let's use... Let's go back to this one here. Uh, wait, stop jumping. And I'm going to change these and stop them being like a one-way round thing. I don't think that's helping me at all. So let's do that. There we go. And I'm wondering whether we could add trams or something in this middle road or buses. We probably don't have many buses here. Let's have a look at our buses. What do we got? Right. We've got a bus that comes right over here. It goes all the way up. Oh my goodness me. All the way up around there. Seriously? To over here? What? What route is this bus line here? Is there any buses going along there that I can look at? Right, this guy here. And Is he a bus? No, he's an oil truck. Oh, is it a bus tour? It's a bus tour. Ah, oh, well, that's okay. Right, all the routes are off apart from buses. We have no bus route in here at all. So I think we could probably do with some little bus routes in here. So I want a bus route that comes to over here. Let's put it that side. Um, and that's going to sort of run through here just to sort of pick people up and bring them back to the train station. And we might just find... Um, if I go just there, so we're near... Yeah, we don't have a crossing there, but I will get a crossing in. Then we'll do one there. No, we won't. We're going to come up here. There we go. Get happy again. And we're going to sort of stop at each of these sections... And down there, oh, there's probably no point that side of the road, is there? Unless we put a crossing in. We'll put a crossing in. 
and then we'll stop there, stop there. So we've got that sort of loop covered. These guys here can take the monorail, so I'm sort of thinking... Why, why, where are these all going? They're all waiting to get into here. Oh my goodness, we've got a backup of monorails. We'll check that in a moment. Yeah, so we'll get that one going. Hopefully that'll encourage more people to take public transportation. And you know what? We could even add a metro in here. Because we have the metro attachments. And that will probably... I bet if we put a metro in, we're going to see a lot less people um, using the monorail and the buses anyway. So, yeah. Come on in. Let's do that. Let's add these in. And see if we can get some nice metro stops in here. Let's use the ones that go straight. We're going to have one there. It's going to come down here and come around the corner. We're going to have one right by this. Let's have it... Should we have it along the back here? Yeah, let's squeeze it along the back here. Because then it's not too far away from that. How many should we have? One there, one there. And then one over here somewhere. So we haven't got too many, but we've got them sort of spread out. I think that's, that's fair. Let's put it on this road. There. Yeah. Let's do that. So let's just line these up. We're going to... Just as I went to click, my mouse jumped. I hate it when that happens. Okay, there we go. Let's go straight down there. And we're going to bring that one straight across there. Connect to there. Let's just delete some of these. And then we'll speed up that corner. Nicey nice. There we go. Good, good. We'll do the same over here. So we'll get that one going straight out. Where's the one up here? There it is. We'll get that one coming straight down to there. That's it. And then we'll speed up that corner. Excellent. Not quite a right angle, but that would do. And then we'll bring this one down here as well. And we'll see. We may even find that we don't need the... Uh, don't need the bus stops after this, but we'll see. We'll see. So let's do that. Whoa. What did I delete there? A train line. Everyone's going to be going nuts now. Let's connect that up. Let's get our train line back in. Apologies about that, my fellow commuters. Excellent. There we go. And then this side over here. Uh, where's my monorail? Me tube. There we go. Excellent. Where's this one here? Then we can always come back and check how that's going a bit later on. Now let's connect these up. Good. There we go. And then we'll have two routes as we tend to do. We'll have clockwise and anti clockwise. There we go. So that'll be Poseidon, Prime Park, Clockwise. Uh, where are we? Are we? Metro Lines. There we go. So Poseidon Prime, Clockwise. Yep. And then we'll just do an anti-clockwise one as well. Let's create a new line. There, there. There, 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 and there. Excellent. Where are we? This one here. Metro lines. Poseidon Prime Park. Region Heights. That's going to be Poseidon Prime Park. County. Clockwise. Excellent. And we'll just put all those back on again. Good. So we'll see how that affects the traffic in this area. Hopefully for the better. There we go. We haven't got any of those. Cool beans. Right. We're growing as well nicely. We're getting up to 100,000, which is absolutely fantastic. Are there any other needs in our city? We're seeing a lot of needs for trash. By the way, I removed this dam here. We've got a nice waterfall now. Uh, this um, dam, you know what I mean. A lot of people are saying, how's this thing going to work with that there? Well, the ships don't go anywhere. They just pop out and you get the money. But yeah, we moved it from there because we didn't need it. So... I mean, look, our city's running so well. We've got hardly any needs at all. This side of the city, we do have 
some needs for trash. So we could check that out. And that's probably the traffic that's causing that. There we go. We've added some more along here as well, which is not far from our shipyard and our new area. And we've upped the budget as well. So hopefully that'll keep us going for a fair while. Okay, so let's take a look at our unique buildings and our monuments because we're starting working towards some of these. Hadron Collider. Oh my goodness, these are going to cost so much money. So we could actually put that in, which offers education to all of our citizens, but we just can't afford it at the moment. Well, that is a shame. Well, I tell you what, we'll keep saving our money. We're going to put the park in here that we were talking about in last episode. So this is Yami Kato Meadows, this area here. And we've got nice, yeah, nice area of people living around there. So we're going to turn this into a park. And it's got this university built into it as well, which I think is rather nice. So let's see what we can do. Let us put a park entrance in. I mean, we could... Go for the nature reserve stuff's nice, but it doesn't really sort of suit this area. I think a city park in here would be good. We're going to go with the small park main gate. Where are we going to put that? I think next to the university. I think that'll be good. Let's pop that in there. Then let's take our paths and sort of run some paths around here. We're going to run that all the way down to here and we're going to add a side entrance park side gate in there if i left myself enough room just about that lines it up and we'll go like that we'll have one there we're gonna have one all the way down here there we go and we can join those up yeah excellent and we've got one there how about one this side as well quite lined up is it let's shiftify that along there we go that's good we'll get that in there excellent excellent and then I mean, we could even add some more over here couldn't we so let's add it's going to mean destroying a couple of buildings but hey ho Whoop. game saving sip of tea mm. excellent there we go so we could do that one there that unattached to there. Yeah, very good. So we've got two that side, one there, one there, one there. So we've got another one over here somewhere. We could just do it right opposite this, couldn't we? Which is not going to line up quite again, but we can fix that. Go like that, and then move it mod that over. There we go. Excellent. So that's connections all over the show. Let's have a look at this. So what have we got? Total visitors have got quite a lot. Entertainment level 185. So we do need to add some items in. Well, of course, we were expecting that. So let's go for, I think, a cafe down here. So you come out of the university, pop over here. There we go. I know that connects up, but people won't walk through here to there. That'll be fine. So don't worry about that. Um, and then we've got the restrooms. Oh, people are using these already. Look at that. We're going to put a couple of restrooms here. We're going to put a restroom or two here. Will that fit in? Yep. Uh, we're going to have an info booth there and down here. Excellent. We haven't got any water in here. Could we fit a park chessboard in? Do you know, we could have a few of these in here. This could be, like, the place to come in town to play chess on these massive park chess boards. There we go. Excellent. We're going to put four in here. Let's line up four. There we go. Plus, people are getting happy and upgrading and all of that stuff, which is what we like. I'm also going to remove these trees in here. I don't want palm trees in there. How big's that? Far too big. Let's go down a bit. Yeah, that'll do. So let's remove all the trees that are in here. There we go. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And what are we going to go for? Let's pick a nice dent. I like these ones because they're nice and dense and green. I mean, they sort of look a bit palm tree-ish. 
Okay, picked a slightly different tree. That other one was leaving all sorts of sand marks on the floor. This one, I think, looks really nice. Look at that. So you've got like a real forested area built into the back. Which is really looking good. I like that. So I might, I think, carry on with these trees all the way over the rest of this area as well. And then as and when we want to add some more items in... There we go. To increase the attractiveness of this park, we can do that. But I think these look really nice. And I think if you lived here, having these nice trees outside the back, we can sort of maybe leave like that little area open there. We could maybe do something there. But I like these. It's this one here. If you want to... U number one. I think it looks really cool. There we go. We're right down the end. Maybe we'll leave this area just sort of open a bit here. We'll put a couple around there. One in there, and then we just sort of fill this bit up along there. Just stick one more in there. Yep. I think that looks nice. I think that looks nice. Trees make a world of difference. Lots of people coming to play chess. Yeah, there we go. Millions of chess players. That is what we want to see. And hopefully that will help these guys upgrade as well. Right. Since I've started doing that, some time has passed. Let's take a look at our new metro line. Oh, number eight line. Did we not name that one for some reason? Poseidon Prime. Oh, there we go. Where's number eight then? Have I not accidentally done... Let's just hover over number eight. Oh, yeah, it's that one there. So what are these ones then? Oh, I've named this one here. That's the wrong one. <laughs> This number eight should be... So that Poseidon Park clockwise is... Question mark. This one is Poseidon Park clockwise. Poseidon Prime, whatever. Yeah, you get the one. Clockwise and anti-clockwise. So, lots of passengers, three vehicles. Do we need more vehicles on here? Is everybody getting picked up? There's space on there, I think. Let's look at that one. Yeah, maybe an extra vehicle on each one. So let's up that to four. And we'll up that one at two, four. Excellent. So how did our new bus line go? It was probably this one. Let's just zoom out so we can see if it starts flashing. Yeah, there we go. So that's the one. Let's check out that line. Ooh, tons of people. Oh, it's this stop here, I think. Let's jump to another stop and jump back. Yeah, the one right outside the train station. Loads of people still want to use it. And this one, which is down here... Grief, that is super busy. So maybe... Yeah, see, we could get bigger buses. People keep saying about getting bigger buses, but I just think at the minute we're going to add some more buses onto that. Let's go... Let's go for 12. And then hopefully that'll be okay. So how has that affected the traffic over here leaving this area? Let's zoom around a bit. Yeah, still lots of traffic coming in. So to me, that says there's people coming from somewhere outside in. So the ones that are in going out, we've got that covered. But coming from the outside in, all of these cars. So we can actually check, can't we? So let's pause. Let's have a look here. So we can press this button here. Toggle traffic routes view. So they're coming into here. It's not showing where they came from, though, which I thought it would. Let's try another one over here. Bug spray van. No, okay. Well, let's pick a piece of road instead, then. And then we're going to turn off pedestrians, cyclists, public transport, cargo, trucks, and everything. So private city vehicles. So lots of them coming from up here. So there's lots coming from outside the city. Ah, okay. So they're coming in from the outside. Travelling in <laughs> through our toll road. Completely forgot we got that there. And then quite a few of them... Yeah, they're all coming. And there's loads coming from over here as well. But yeah, they're coming down here and heading straight into here. Okay. There's also quite a lot coming from here. Which is all sorts of other places. Oh, this is what I was looking for before. Look. There we go. Oh, I've accidentally not clicked on that road anymore. Let's go that road again. There we go. So, visitors coming from these sort of places. I mean, we do have trains that they can take. But the vast majority are coming from the outside. And then quite a few visitors coming from here. So, 
do we have a train station in here? We do. We've got this one. Corrigan Station. It's hooked up via tube as well. Yeah, and we've got this station here. So these people could use that tube to get round to Corrigan Station. And then the train will bring them over to here. We've set that up already, haven't we? So I think it's these ones coming in from the outside. We need to try and do something with that. So what could we do? I mean, we could literally put a train station up here somewhere. <laughs> what is that line? I don't know. Uh, we could put a train station up here. So people coming into the city will park up, jump on a train and come in. Because where would be the nearest one? If they're all coming down here. Let's click on this road again. Let's use our detective skills. So if we click on, we'll just do that and click on that. And then we can click on the piece of road. There we go. So the nearest train station for these guys, if they were going to do so, would actually mean coming off of here and then driving through up to that one. Or this one. Yeah, so there's no easy way to sort of come off, is there? Oh, they could come off of here, couldn't they? To there. It would mean coming around there and up there. So there is a train station. This city station here. And I'm a wondering... I'm a wondering... Didn't mean to sound Italian there. I'm wondering whether... I mean, it's allowing intercity trains is off. But the traffic... You know, the external traffic shouldn't be a problem. I mean... I think it's just something we need to maybe adjust here. Have another little addition coming round to this roundabout. I just think it's too much traffic through there. Let's see whether we can take this road here and attach it to here. And if it just splits the traffic a bit, whether that would help. We can try. We can but try. Uh, let's just take a normal a normal road for now. Let's come out from here. So that's going to sort of go down there. Okay, well, let's go to that. And sort of go to here. Boom, 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 boom. And then we'll grab that one. And can we just literally have that come off of here somewhere? Slope too steep, slope too steep. Oh, we've unlocked. There we go. Yamaka Town Meadows. Excellent. I'm going to just anarchy that in because I think it should be fine. Can we not turn that around, please? Why can't we turn that around? Oh, there we go. We can put the anarchy back on. There we go. Good. So that's going to come off of there <laughs> very steeply. <laughs> Let's move that along a bit so it's not quite so steep. There we go. Move that one along a bit as well. There we go. That's better. So they can now come off of there and head around this way. It's going to take a while for all of those cars to decide. And what we could also do is... Two-lane, two-way. I want two-lane, one-way. Let's upgrade this. So some can come off if they so desire. So we're going to do this. Whoops. There we go. Yeah, there we go. We've got that going off and that going on. And we'll sort of see how that goes. We've got two lanes going off, two lanes going on. Just seeing whether we could change any of this. Yeah, we'll leave that like that now. That should hopefully sort of sort itself out. And we'll see whether this gets split. And whether this just moves a little bit quicker down here. And we're going to change this. Do, 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 to this one. Uh, we're actually going to change it to this one. Three lane. Yep. There we go. Oh, uh, hang on a sec. Let's not mess up this roundabout. Yeah, we're going to anarchy that road in. Just while we do this. Uh, three lane. There it is. As this roundabout is three lane, we'll do that. Yep, there we go. Excellent. We've got three lanes coming in. Two lanes split into three lanes. That should be okay. It's not too busy down here, is it? Yeah, we'll see how that goes. 
Hopefully that will help. I mean, already, look, it's not backing up so much. Let's hope it doesn't back up too much down here. I mean, to be honest, we could just make all of this three lane one way because... Yeah, there we go. Let's go with that as it's got a... Oh, hang on, we've got one coming off. We can't have that coming off there, can we? Um... Yeah, we really don't need that road. I'm going to leave it there for looks. I don't think anyone's going to take that road. Hmm. We'll think about that and we'll see how that one goes. And a few minutes later, hardly any traffic at all coming down either of these routes. Splitting it up's worked really well. Some funky lane changing going on here, but it's all moving along nicely. And I think more and more people are using the public transportation that we put in our new area here, which is growing really, really well. I'm liking this area. 98,000. We're so close to 100k and we're earning money as well. Perfect. Just what I want to see. So if you want to see some more, haha, <laughs> what a great segue. Hit the big B with the T stain to subscribe. Be back here tomorrow. Also, don't forget if you like uh, Civilization 6. If a play strategy, my other channel has started up again. You can go and check out that on there, playing it on the Switch. I will see you very soon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.